Hey guys, today we are going to test out if you can actually put your swim bag in the washer. The bags usually say to just spot treat, but I just got a new swim bag, as you can see right here. This is my old one, I don't have any use for it anymore, so I thought, well, we can test it out and just see. Also because no one's really going to go through the effort to like get one of those little Tide pens and like go meticulously do a spot treatment just to get out one stain. And normally when these do get dirty, it's kind of just an all over getting thrown on pool decks, dirty pool deck water getting splashed on them. So they get overall dirty and you can't really spot treat that. So we're just going to throw it in and see how it goes. So if we completely destroy this bag, we'll destroy it together and I have a backup. So we're all set. Oh, this is scaring him. Bye. So we're just going to toss this in here. If there's nothing in it. I emptied it all into there. At least I hope I'm not missing anything. We're going to use some distilled white vinegar and the washing stuff. This giant thing. The <laughs> washing detergent, I knew that. And then I'm gonna wash this on cold just so the color doesn't bleed and because it does say the spot treat so I think if we wash it on hot we could risk damaging it. Washing it on cold isn't gonna get all the bacteria off of it so I'm gonna use distilled white vinegar because that'll help gently get any bacteria out of it even though we're washing it on cold. And it will help protect the color so <sighs> nice tip there. And just put this into the fabric softener bin, drawer, hole, cup thing. I'm just gonna put it on normal. Wash temperature is gonna be cold. And we're gonna start. Fingers crossed, toes crossed. Don't ruin my bag. Okay, I'll be back when this is done and put it in the dryer and then I'll be back when it's all done. That's really loud. Alright guys, it's all done. Let's get it out. It looks squished. Alright, it doesn't feel too wet, but I mean, there's still some stains on the white Speedo in the front, and that was where it was the dirtiest, and it is oh, cleaner. It doesn't smell like pee anymore. For some reason it smelled like pee right before I got a new one, so yeah, I don't know what happened there. So I'm going to try to turn this inside out just so none of the zippers and buckles damage my dryer. Oh, that looks weird. Got the straps in there so this doesn't flap out because there are zippers there. I'm going to zip this up. Okay, let's put it in the dryer. Also, putting a towel in there can help. That way it's not just the bag getting thrown around. It has something bulky to absorb some of the moisture and just help it roll a little bit better. I love that noise. So I'm just going to put this on delicate just to be safe. Just start it. I'll check back in with you guys when this is done. And we're going to see if it's dry. Oh. Oh, it's nice and warm in here. It feels good. I'm cold. <laughs> Every time I look at it, I laugh because it just looks so stupid. Um, the inside of it's the outside of it isn't dry. It's actually pretty wet in there. I'm going to open the top a little bit more and then put it back in for one more cycle to see if it helps dry out in here. One more time and I will be right back. So there's one minute left on that, so we're going to wait for just a minute. I thought I'd tell you about these amazing cubbies for holding my swim stuff. My mom built these, actually, which is really cool. It has like, a bench down here, the two different cubbies, and then there's cubbies up here that hold, um, I'll just show you, cubbies up here that hold bins of my swim stuff. So that's what's in there. I have two of these purple bins, and then my sister has two bins over here too. She built these all from scratch. I helped, of course, but yeah. So I tell you guys about that. And uh, this feels like a really long minute. Come on. Why won't you ding? Just ding. Come on. This is a fake minute. You're lying to me. It's like a three minute, one minute. I give up. Okay. Yeah, it actually feels pretty dry. Let's turn this right side down again. I am actually really impressed by this. I didn't think this was going to work. It worked. <laughs> this 
is so cool. So now you guys know if one of your bags gets really dirty and you can't get a new one, take all your stuff out of it, put it in the wash, and then make sure you turn it inside out when you put it in the dryer. So save yourself some money and just throw it in the wash. Yay! I've always wanted to try doing this, so I thought I'd make it into video for you guys when I did try it. Thank you so much for watching. Please give it a big thumbs up if it was helpful, and subscribe if you haven't already to see my next videos. Bye! Hi. I won't focus. Focus! 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 Alien light. Ha <laughs> ha.